For years, these Roman catacombs were closed off, but now the Vatican has decided to open them completely. In fact, thanks to Google Maps, people from every corner of the globe can see the catacombs of Priscilla. The Pontifical Commission for Sacred Archaeology, which is headed by Cardinal Gianfranco Ravazzi, agreed to give the catacombs a digital presence. This is actually the first time that something like this happens. It was carried out by Google Maps, and you'll be able to see that it truly is an unedited experience that gives people the possibility of visiting the catacombs through different means. And so, history and new technology come together to show users miles of the catacombs. This one in particular gives special insight on how early Christians lived in Rome. It houses the oldest fresco depicting the Virgin Mary, and also items that marked someone's death, for example. And also paintings from the 3rd and 4th centuries. The catacombs are important because they provide physical proof of Christian history. It shows how early Christians lived out their faith. They expressed it along with frescoes and sculptures that are now part of this new museum. Actually walking, or rather clicking, through the catacombs is easy. In addition to Google Maps, the museum has a new website that can directly connect users to their digital tour experience. It also shows how some of those historical pieces were restored, including items that were found underground. Among the lists are more than 700 sarcophagi fragments, which can now be seen at the museum. It's been more than 1,700 years since these frescoes were first painted and since these sculptures were made. But in this case, technology is being used to travel back in time.